These are what they were looking for is in the rear of the house. If the officers approached that particular part of the house, the individual fled out of the house. I believe he ran out of a, a rear window. The officers gave the suit. Uh, the confrontation struck, uh, occurred in the middle of the block here in the 2600 block of uh, West Bates. At that particular time, uh, the individual was fighting with one of the officers over his particular service weapon. Uh, several shots were fired. Uh, the individual was struck. We believe he has been denounced at this particular time. Uh, three officers that were involved in the struggle with him were all injured. The injuries were minor. Uh, one is at the hospital and the other one is on his way. Uh, be mindful that this is a very preliminary. As we get more information, uh, there's more to find. I'll be sure to have someone share it with you. So can you go back and you said three officers? Were yeah, three officers were involved in the struggle with the individual. Uh, in the midst of that struggle, uh, the individual apparently was fighting over one of the officer's service weapons, at which time shortly thereafter several shots were fired, uh, striking the individual, and uh, we believe he was pronounced. At this time, I'm not going to release the name of the, the uh, deceased or the officers. The officers obviously will, will be placed in administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation. And just again, uh, the injuries to the officers, are all uh, three of them injured? Yeah, three officers were injured. We believe all of them are minor, maybe with the exception of one, but none of them are life threatening. Uh, several warrants. Uh, again, I, I am un I'm unclear on exactly what the warrants were, but I believe some were felony warrants and some were misdemeanor warrants. As we get that information, I'll be sure to share that with you also. Okay. Thank you very much.